Hi, I would like to take you through the step-by-step -step process of cleaning the manual coffee grinder by Continental Shift. It's quite a straightforward process. You just need to be mindful of the order in which you take the components apart. So essentially, there are three parts to this. Uh, the hopper and the cap don't really need any explanation. Uh, however, the barrel of it uh, we can go through now. So you have the adjusting wheel here. If you just hold on to the, the rod at the other end and just unscrew this. Then you remove the ceramic burr. A steel washer, spring, and as you pull out the rod, so should the plastic. There we go. There's a plastic washer there as well. So I just put those in order. And there you have it. You've actually, that's all it takes to take it apart. Uh, now to clean it, um, this is actually a uh, a new device there, or a new unit that hasn't been used before, but assuming that it was in need of a clean, it would have um, brown stains from the resin of the coffee beans on the ceramic burr, on the blade here. So just get a Q-tip and some soapy water, and all you do is you just slim, simply clean around the grooves until clean. Then rinse it. Once done, you get the barrel again, and as you can see inside there, the other half of the blade, and the same thing applies, just use a Q-tip, go around, clean it, rinse it. And I would say you just really need to let it dry thoroughly before putting any beans back in there or you'll get some sort of clogging. Uh, what you can do is you can put them in a dishwasher. I mean, I do myself. Um, I would refrain from putting the spring and the two washers in for obvious reasons. Um, the rest of it can go in, but I would say that the, the adjusting wheel and the, uh, the blade would really need to go into the cutlery compartment and be sealed. Okay, so putting back together is just a reverse process of what we've just done. The rod goes in. The plastic washer the spring, the steel spring, the ceramic burr. Just be careful it's now sprung loaded so you perhaps want to just hold your thumb on it as you put the adjusting wheel back on. Tighten it up. Now you need to be careful not to over tighten this because damage uh, may occur to the blade the ceramic blade inside. So my advice would be to tighten it up and then just back it off a good few notches. Put your coffee beans in, grind it, see if it's the fineness or the coarseness that you're looking for and then just adjust it from there. Hopper, cap and the crank handle. Also remember that the crank handle must always go in a clockwise motion. And there you have it, that's all it really takes to disassemble, clean and reassemble. We do include an instruction leaflet uh, which is included in the box and inside all the components are clearly labelled and on the back you have also the order in which they connect together. So there you have it. If you keep it clean and you'll have Many years of happy grinding.